pandemonium. Pandemonium in the White House, in the higher regions, and below the earth, in Italy and in Rome. All of this uncovered, but unspoken of. Do you realize that things are happening that you know not of? Because they are hidden from you, says the Lord. But look to the fall. I made you a light for the world to see America. My love. made you a voice for the world to hear America you are my love you are my love you are my light you are my song in the night You are my smile, you are my voice In troubled times, I call to you You are my light America, you are my voice of my son. I brought you forth for myself, America, my love. I do not care what anybody says. God called this nation to be a light. Yes, it has flaws. So does Israel. Yes, it has imperfections. But did I call my people to perfection? I said you would be a light shining in a dark place. I said you would be a hand that would feed the hungry. And I gave you oil to heal nations. And I gave you my breath to sing. Even your national anthem has my breath on it now they are foes ISIS ISIS is not an Islamic state it is a God that was worshipped centuries and millennia ago starting with Nimrod that same spirit has rested upon the East, Middle East, and is knocking at your door. But you have acknowledged me as the Lord God of your nation. I cease will cease to influence and exist on the streets of my soil America and Israel and Western nations you shall put your fist down on Turkey you shall put your fist down on Russia Syria and Iran ISIS heads 
lives have been taken from children. I do not like that, says the Lord. Therefore, I have come to the earth to examine and to inspect, to see how I shall judge you in the presence of your enemies. No, 9-11 attempt shall be to their satisfaction, says the Lord. No, but watch Chicago and watch Michigan. For there are terrors that draw closer and closer to banish the sounds of praise. Israel has praised me and shall continue. My people, Ecclesia, shall praise me and they shall continue. Therefore, I am the guardian of this nation and I will put a stop to it and expose, expose, expose in the fall until you realize that I have spoken and it is so, says the Lord of hosts. Come on! Come to us, we pray, with open hands we say, you are welcome, you are welcome in our homes. Come to us, we pray, with open hearts we say, you are welcome, and you are welcome in our land. I pray today, Lord, that as our hands and our hearts are united, let the washing of the water of the Word take place now. Sprinkle in every home and on every doorpost. May your words and laws be written in the streets of America, in the streets of England, the streets of Europe, the streets of your nations. Sprinkle the blood on the doorposts that the angel of death that has desired the nation may that blood cry out may that blood cry out from every doorpost of your people may your blood cry out of better things than that of Abel. I pray, stop the division and the discord in this nation and hear the prayers of your saints, even if it's just today, as hundreds of thousands will draw together all over the earth. Our one goal is to praise you and to lift you up. It doesn't matter if I don't preach or do anything. What we will do today as nations is worship you. We will lift you up, Lord, from this den and from our homes. Be glorified, O oh God. Let your glory cover the earth as the waters cover the sea. Let your glory be above the heavens. Let your glory fill the earth, I pray. I pray that your presence, Lord God, would drive back our enemies. I pray like Jehoshaphat prayed as he stood before the nations and he said, Here they have come to take us away from our possession which you have given us to inherit. Lord, we have an inheritance. We have an inheritance and that inheritance we will receive that kingdom that you have promised to us we will receive kingdom come kingdom come kingdom come kingdom come kingdom come come all over the world there are people standing 
under the power of this Holy Spirit that is present say it with me kingdom come kingdom come kingdom come 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 and your will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who have trespassed against us deliver us from evil lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil for yours is the kingdom power glory forever and ever and everybody watching me that has been influenced by the power of the prognosis given by our new news media I break the power of that now what you have is a permeating of hope coming to you from one who has stepped into the future as far as 2019 that's what I've done by his spirit to tell you that a season of war cannot remain a season of war seasons change this will come to an end and rejoicing and celebration will once again be on the streets of Jerusalem and in the streets of America that is all I have to say about that come on prepared what have I prepared for the nations of the earth what have I prepared for the nations of the earth this is the latter part of what the Spirit gave me what have I prepared for New Zealand what have I prepared for Ukraine what have I prepared for Russia, Estonia, Europe, and the Middle East? Yes, Yeshua is moving to a people who are dissatisfied. There is only one God, but Allah, they say. Be up a little. There is only one God but Allah. Would you know, like to know what the Lord has to say? There is only one God but God. There is only one God but God. And I will go where I wish. I was able to tear down the wall through Ronald Reagan. But there are two more walls that will come down. And in 2018, at the celebration of Israel's birthday, there shall be an outpouring of my spirit in Israel like it has not had since the days of David and the days of Jesus you listen to me everybody but I have prepared my Holy Spirit who is part of our Godhead our Trinity to bring upon the earth and especially America, Canada, France, the Netherlands, Germany, and many others. A move of the Holy Spirit that will creep over into the streets of the Middle East and they shall be Damascus Road 
conversions take place in the highest places in terrorist organizations and they shall come out and they shall reveal the truth and the evil of Islam and there shall be a shaking in the kingdom and the way that I shook in 1900 at the turn of the century 1948 in the 60s and the 70s I will accumulate them all in one Come on. and I shall pour out of my spirit with a global renewal says the Lord yeah. you to hear me please because that song not even specifically the melody but the hallelujah will suddenly emerge and begin to be sung all over the world they say that Islam is attracting young people but the spirit told me and I saw this all over the world Jesus became popular Jesus became famous again a fame that is worthy of him conversions will take place in universities and schools And the people that are professors and teachers that have taught all this erroneous crap yeah. in the presence of these I will raise up scientists yep. that will speak the truth and it will spread and people will try and stop it but it will not be stopped this shall spread and spread and spread and there will be no control for it shall be like a river that's what I saw now many of you watching all over the world you know what I do there is an altar you've heard it directly from the Spirit of God how he is going to move from one nation to the other through the streets house churches will be just about in every street in the United States of America and in Europe every street every neighborhood shall have the ability and to hear the gospel of the kingdom for God will not allow his son to return but will retain him until the fulfillment 
of every prophetic word that the prophets prophesied and the one thing that is being restored at this very moment in the midst of rubble in the midst of clay in the midst of Maya is the tabernacle of David the restoration of the tabernacle of David will bring about souls into the kingdom by the millions the tens of millions and it shall be known spoken about by time magazine and i saw a new magazine that is also going to come forth come on. not necessarily on paper alone of course not to be on the internet but that shall speak of christ yes. but it shall use the finest of scientists the finest of athletes the finest of artists the finest of economists and business people prosperity is at our door now you may say that doesn't look possible do not say that because what god requires from you now is faith you see faith is the only thing that can please god it says without faith it is impossible to please him if you're watching me now you heard the word of the lord you receive faith you know what i love about the prophetic is you get so close to the heart of god you hear his mind his thoughts what he plans to do you know you need this on a regular basis and there are millions of viewers all over the world that experience this twice a week sometimes even more at my den and you can experience it as well I'd love to have you there all you got to do is go to Kim.tv we have so much we have worship we have songs that come from the heart of God prophetic words about things that have not happened yet that's what we we say to the people welcome to the future and i want you to experience that i look forward to